inside this container we have some cuttings that were recently made about two months ago and we're going to test and see how they look we'll start to pull them up and see how well they come out oh they're really in there look at that look at the roots on that hmm it's so it is a very easy way to grow plants here's another one Ooh -cha. Ooh -cha, ooh -cha, ooh -cha, ooh -cha. really massive set of roots there now what we'll do is we'll take these out of this container here and put each one of these in an individual pot and then we'll have them ready to plant out this spring into the field it's a very simple system you only have to use a cutting of about five to six inches long and put about two inches in soil and what we like to use is we like to use a rooting hormone when we plant these because that does in fact help the success rate of growing new roots we're going to be testing three different ways to try and root these lilacs the first way is we're just going to do a straight stick where it goes into the soil the second is we've dipped the lilac into a compound, a rooting compound called Hormodin 3. This gave it a light dip and then we stick it. And in the third method, we're adding something to the straight stick. And that is, we're going to add a small piece of a willow tree along with it to see if that helps promote root growth. So as you can see in this pot, all the cuttings have a small willow stem put right next to the stem of the lilac to see if that helps promote root growth. So we'll see, we'll have three different ways. We have a straight stick where you just stick it, then it's stuck with a rooting compound, and then it's stuck with a piece of willow right next to the lilac stem and we'll see after about two months the difference between the three ways we're doing this if you need help with plant selections call us at highland hill farm we'd be glad to offer assistance